Should we dub this cache that we found today a B rated cache? So stay tuned. So we're in between Howard and Avoki, New York, getting a couple of geocaches today. So this one's going to be a quick one. We did find it before with the kids, but we're going to see if there's any more trinkets that we are interested in in there and just... We <laughs> <laughs> wear bees with this one, guys. So we found it, and we've came to realize that it was completely empty. There was a log paper, but all of the stuff that was in here the last time um, are gone, and so we are going to add a couple of things in there so other people can find. We thought it was fitting because of the camo duct tape to add these army figurines to the cache. <laughs> so my opinion it's very important to go back to caches that you previously see fine um, because there could be trackables in there but also there could be nothing in there and so that's what happened the owner or someone took the all of the trinket that was in there and so we added a few things like we said earlier so it's very important just to repeat and go through the caches that you already done because you never know what would be in there. <laughs> 